So my group in the Department of Aerospace Engineering studies turbulence, which is the chaotic swirling of air or water or other fluid. And that's useful for all sorts of technologies. So uh, these things called turbulent boundary layers are these narrow regions of chaotic swirling fluid that coat planes, they coat ships, they coat trains, anything that kind of moves through air or water has these regions around them that are swirling and we study those areas. So the research we're doing right now in the group is mostly focused on uh, unsteady flows coupled with turbulent boundary layers. So what happens if a plane turns or accelerates? What happens if uh, a ship has to turn? We don't understand that well what actually happens near the flow really close to the, the ship or the plane. Uh, and, and so our questions are how do we understand that flow? How do we experimentally recreate that flow in the laboratory? And then can we improve the modeling of those of those flows so that uh, we can better predict the behavior in, in the reality? I taught incompressible flow for juniors and sophomores, uh, which is a flow which is a class about how air moves uh, at relatively low speeds, so takeoff and landing or commercial flight. Um, so we learn a lot about that in that class, and then I've also taught this freshman class, which is really fun. On we make gliders and we make rockets, and they do. Uh, group work to build these things and test them and then we have competitions to see kind of who can either fly the farthest or, or hit a particular altitude for the rocket.